Hi, it's Lee, and today I'm going to be making um, chicken broccoli alfredo in the crock pot. Um, the ingredients will are a pound of chicken, um, two 16 ounce jars of alfredo sauce, a half a cup of bacon, a bag of a, just a pound bag of broccoli, and one green pepper chopped. I'm not going to be using the green pepper today because I don't have any, but I just wanted to let you know that that's um, one of the ingredients. So we're going to start off with a pound of chicken. I already dropped some bacon in there, and my cats are fighting in the background. Um, so we're going to start off by dumping in oops, <laughs> two jars of Alfredo sauce. I have one regular and one light. I don't think that's going to make any difference. And then you need half a cup of bacon. You can either fry up some bacon and crumble it and throw that in, or you can cheat like I did and buy a bag of real bacon bits and throw that in. It took pretty much the whole bag. I'm going to hold off on the broccoli for about an hour or so so that it doesn't get so mushy. But, um, then this is where you'd also add your green pepper um, and then you mix it up a little bit and put it on the crock pot on low for six to eight hours or on high for four to six hours I'm gonna be putting it on high um, and I'll be back in a little bit thanks also even though the recipe didn't really call for it I went ahead and added a teaspoon of um, a teaspoon each of garlic and um, onion powder just to add a little more flavor. I might, once it's cooked a little more, I might add some black pepper, but we'll see. <laughs> okay, so it's been cooking on high for about two hours, and I've decided I'm going to add a little pepper. And I'm going to dump in the broccoli Oops. and knock stuff over too. So I have one pound bag of petite broccoli florets. <laughs> and then I have a little bit of leftover broccoli from something I made the other day, so I'm going to go ahead and add that in so it doesn't go to waste. Um, and on top of the broccoli, because I like garlic on my broccoli, I'm going to add just a little bit of, where is it, of garlic powder to make the broccoli tasty. We'll stir that up and let it cook for the next, uh, I guess two to three hours. Um, or whenever the chicken is done and I'll uh, be back to show you what it looks like when it's all cooked and ready to eat. 